time to get in the car. Oh, oh wait, no, we already did. Oh, We're here. Oh, oh, are we oh. here? No, we no, need to okay, get in the car. Yeah, get in the car. Should I drive? Why not? Get in I, that car, this, boy. This is tripping me out. Welcome back. Hi, I'm Gerald. Hi, I'm Albert. Your name's not Albert. <laughs> Your name isn't Gerald. Well, the world. Th you know what, guys? We're just the off-brand version of Hey Arnold. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I got you. All right. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we need to go to Mendez's. Let's apartment. go to Mendez's. Let's go to Mendez's. Yo, Gerald. What are you? Everybody needs to chill. I'm I'm always chill. I'm. That's not police. true. Police. I need to go. I'm always chill. That's the truth. Unless the fucking fight controls don't work, and then. You know, that's when you, <laughs> you don't know what to punch. That's when I order three fingers worth of rye and I learn about the realities of being a cop. So who is Mendez exactly? Can we get a recap on Mendez who? owns the car that the guy McCall made the license plate for. But I'm starting to suspect because he had that license plate number ready to go before he even knew the cops were coming. Yeah. And it's also he has motive to steal the goddamn ring back. Alonzo so I'm Mendes. a little bit nervous. Sounds you like think it's a, a frame job? Don't sound like a man I'd let my daughter in here. Oh You've my god, he's racist, dude. Enough time drinking, Cole, you'll find yourself with any number of things so Oh my god, dude. Never sober up. Exactly. Damn. This guy's a bad cop. This guy's bad at his job. Sir, I'm gonna need you to get out of the street and don't smoke. It's bad for you. Don't smoke, it's bad for you! A little more uh, rush hour humor for you guys. <laughs> Remember when? Yo, thank uh, you guys for making the Saw episode so popular. It's the most popular episode of the year so far for Completionist. The most popular episode of anything on YouTube? Is that what you said? No, of the Completionist so the most far. Most popular of this video year. Of 2016? Of so far, Saw featuring the Super Beard Bros. That's the biggest one. Biggest one so far. Eat it, Sai. So, get, get it, Gangnam Style. <laughs> Only, uh, like. Two billion more views to go. We'll catch so up. So was it apartment sixteen? They said. Yeah, on the fourth floor. Mendez apartment sixteen. Mendez. Shout out to that super high res number art there. All right. <laughs> Mendez, fourth floor. Yeah. Because you feel there's only so many. Yeah. See, look. Go back. I get it. Bam. I get it. Game. If there's Here, four. The apartments up on the top floor. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Feel okay. the burn. Okay. I don't think any of these people are voting for Bernie Sanders. <laughs> don't bother knocking. Just kick the door in. All right. You heard the man. Oh. Take a look around and see what you can find. Okay. Uh, what are we, what are we looking for here? Let's see. Is this a thing? Doesn't okay. Like the main, you know, honestly, of all the things that I'm looking for, the main thing that I want to find, you want to know what it is? I'm going to say you're going to want to find, because this, one is, thing the, this, that this hasn't is added the, up yet. this is a common thing we've been finding at every crime scene is a shoe. That's what I'm saying. I want to find a shoe that it's says size, size eight. eight. Yeah. Survey says. You're a size eight boy, aren't you? Dirty size eight Ooh. shoe. Mr. Mendez, you Ooh. sick puppy. Mr. Mendez is oh, the one Mr. who's Mendez, been a murder boy. You nasty, nasty boy. Let's look around for some more stuff. All Ooh, right. some more. Oh my god. Is that a gun? Okay. Seems irrelevant. Seems irrelevant? It's a gun! It's a handgun, bro. It doesn't get more relevant than that. I mean, maybe she didn't get shot, but... What else am I looking for here? What do we think? Well, if he's the killer, the, the weapon must be here. What? Let's look for more... What was that? Oh, a key? I don't think so. These are all things that are like such clues. A gun and a key? What if it's the key to the car? What is that? Where are we looking? This? 
That's the front door here, right? Yeah, that's where we came from. Kitchen? We heard it earlier, didn't we? The chime? Eggs? Not sure this I love me some eggs. Cause all I know is eggs. Guys, check out our new album, Big Big Bad Bosses. Power Overwhelming is available now on iTunes. Let me shift a roll hard. <laughs> Way those rancheros. This is just nothing, right? This is a bon canero. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing there. Back in the room, maybe? Oh. Oh my god, how did I miss this? Consistent with Celine's injuries, and the blood can be typed. Gotcha, bro. Oh, look at that! The lipstick! Oh my god! Can you grab that now? How do we miss that? It's just a box with all the clues in it that we need. Zoom in. Brothers same kind. The color and brand of the body. Classic Carmine. It's the same thing that was in her purse. That's so weird. All right. I have the murder weapon. Better get Pinker down here. <coughs> Why is there a cutscene? Why not throw it away? Think these clowns are geniuses? Thank your star. Oh, we found all the break. clues. Yeah, Donald begin to like you. Hey, what gives? LAPD, oh my god, he's arrest. taking off. Watch. Oh shit! What Do gives? That son of a bitch. I'll go get our Come on, Jason. Mendez, stop right there. Come on, run, bro. God damn. All right. Get in there, Alex. Get in there. I can't pull my gun. I think we're not supposed to. If you can't pull your gun, you're probably not supposed to. You don't need to do this, Alonzo. The question is why? He's like the least important person in this case so far. God damn, is he getting in a car? Yeah, he's in a car. Get in and drive. Get in and drive, you heard the man. Alright. Let's go. Alex, what have you learned in car chases? Kill the guy in the car. Run him over. Doesn't matter where the cops. Turn your siren back on. I didn't mean to turn it off. Turning radius is so bad. Oh my god. Okay, he may be dead, but who cares? Oh! Okay, we may have ruined the cop light, but we're fine. Don't let him get away. Keep it up. I believe in you. Oh my god. We're All right. cops. I got an idea. Get him next to my window, call. Keep what are you me alongside gonna do? his vehicle and I'll stop the son of a bitch. What's he gonna do? Shoot him? That's scary. I wish that Oh! I... Stay close to the left rear bumper on the suspect's vehicle to give him a clear shot. You didn't try and shoot the tires, maybe? Don't go to sleep on me. Get me back in close. I'm not asleep on you, dude. I'm flying down the streets of Los Angeles at like 80 miles an hour in the 40s. Uh, I heard a... Oh! Woo! Oh my god. Get out quick before he dies. Well, I got him. You're under arrest for the murder of Sleep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> this fits so much better all the evidence that we got. But I'm still suspicious because that it's so weird that he gave her the ring and then he wants it like I want to look up it? a little trivia, Alex. Like, I got some trivia right here for you. About this case? About this case. I is, I'm very that. interested in it. This case is highly influenced by the murder of Jean French. Jean French was a 45-year-old army nurse who was discovered stripped and stomped to death early in, this, in the morning in February months. 1947. Phelps. Okay. That's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing. The case was never officially solved, but supposedly linked to the infamous Black Dahlia murder case because the initials BD were written on, with lipstick on the on French's dead body. Wow. The murder also took place just weeks after the murder of Elizabeth Short, Black Dahlia, who also which also took place in 1947 Los Angeles. Wow. Hell yeah, dude, I'm getting praised. I'm getting praised here, folks. Are we drinking this guy's whiskey right now? I kind of feel worried about that. Dude, he didn't take a drink. 
Hey, you were right. The actress that plays the neighbor also worked on Mad Men. Crushed it. She plays the secretary, I think. <sighs> Look at that. No injuries. Perfect dick. Did I reset the injury? Did I reset the injury scale when I, when I like reset the? I don't know. I don't know how that happened. Jacob Henry is left to mourn while Mendez waits in lockup for a visit from the DA. I don't. I mean, I feel like there's like a lot of loose ends to this case that we didn't tie up. Yeah, but we're, that's not our job, you know. I guess so. It's just like somebody broke into her house and took the ring. What's our next case, game? It's weird. I feel like I'm putting away the wrong man. Oh, main plot time. This oh, back to the blue room. To cool the love God damn, that was crazy. This episode of Beers Bro, Beer Bros brought to you not by El Pollo Loco, but could be. What does that mean? <laughs> it means I had El Pollo Loco for lunch, and I'd appreciate it if they sponsored us. Oh. You just want a moment more El Pollo, El Loco, Pollo Loco. The Golden Butterfly. So he went by himself to watch the singer again? Is that what we were supposed to understand from this? Who went? Cole? Sorry, I was making It's just like obsessing over the singer. Drink. All right, well, let's see what happens with the Golden Butterfly. Do we know if this is a DLC case or not? This is a regular case. Okay. Uh -oh. I have a little checklist of like. Uh oh. <gasps> Dude, everybody's oh, just getting murdered with tire iron. Everyone irons all the time. loves the tire iron. God damn it. Galloway. Got it, Skipper. Come on, yeah, kid. I'll bring him. He's my partner, after all. What have we got? New case. White female dumped in plain sight in the grass at the end of Hill Street. Hacks are all over it. Captain's trying to fend him off. That sounds awfully similar. The first rule of police work is make no assumptions until you've seen the evidence. Skipper wants you to have so your weird to be a policeman who's like paranoid about like serial killers. The place where they found the lady. <laughs> Everything is murder. Let's go. Everything is murder. Mm. Why do you think it's murder all the time? <laughs> I don't know. I've seen a lot of murders. Murder. It's from uh, Hot Fuzz. I want to watch that movie That's right this It's moment. a great movie. I haven't seen Gabriel's it in... homework. Watch that movie. I haven't seen it since, like, the day it came out in theaters. Well, maybe I've watched it, like, once I've or watched, twice. I've watched a triple feature of Edgar Wright movies. It made me so happy. For, uh... Six and a half hours, Scott I saw... Pilgrim? I saw Shaun of the Dead, Should Hot I drive? Fuzz, I'm gonna and... Drive. Yeah. You saw Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz, and Scott Pilgrim in one showing? Hell yeah. Oh! At the new... Oh! At the New Beverly. I just ran my ass off the road. At the New Beverly. Job That's great. The case, that probably was a great show. Not bad for your first time See, bed. this guy respects me That's now. Rusty. Don't go getting ahead of yourself. That's Edgar Wright was there. Under your belt. Now it's a new day with a new dead I didn't, lady. I wanted him to sign attention. that poster. That I, see, that that's actually the poster right there. You see it on my wall? Yeah. Right. That's right. where it came from. See, I Let's uh, throw a picture of the poster up. Patrick or Chris, take a photo of that poster. It's actually behind... Frazier's uh, computer in our room, so. Yeah, I like kind of look at it every day. Yeah. Oh my god. You went under the tunnel. <laughs> you went under to the tunnel. You went under to the tunnel. And now you gotta go through the lobby to get some more refreshments for your food. <laughs> and now you gotta go to the lobby. Okay, so I'm gonna try and go like around this way, maybe. I think I'm gonna be able to, yep. There you go. Breaking <laughs> yeah. the law, breaking the law. Check out this divider. All right. Breaking the law, breaking the law. They might need it, law. I'm just bringing it up to them. They might need it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that didn't work. Uh. <laughs> All right. You know what? just ate shit. Sometimes you when you're- just Shit, and you're still driving. Sometimes when you're doing police work, you know, danger can come at you from an angle you didn't expect, and that's, you know, I, if anything, I praise LA Noir for being so, <laughs> so edgy about it. <laughs> just to show you, just to show you that there's danger lurking around every corner, you know what I mean? Oh my god, get out of here, you know Darkwing Duck. Yeah, like, that's what it's about, you know? Okay. Like, that's. All right. I saw my life flash before my eyes. 
<laughs> and you know, I you know the fact that I live like I'm gonna you carry that with me. You don't have a door me. anymore. I'll get one. Now, boys, I'll boys, get one back. You know as much as I do. I'll be holding a press conference once the autopsy is being completed. You should be able to arrest a reporter who shows up on a scene like that. Yeah. I don't understand why you can't. You can't do that nowadays, unfortunately. You should get a ticket for $400 every time. Yo, you know why the... Elizabeth Short is the Black Dahlia murder, the popular one. Yeah. We have the greatest police force in all the world with the greatest scientific investigators at our disposal. This guy is like turning the pressure on. I mean, he does have the perfect dicks on his team. Dude, this guy is. Yeah, right. This guy is like a poet. Yo, that dude also is one of the Irishmen. He's the Irishman in uh. We have God's work to do here on it. Uh, what is it? Oh, Kings in New York. No. Yeah. What? What Irishman? He's what? He's like they call him the Irishman in Kings in New York. Isn't everyone an Irishman in Gangs in New York? No. You racist. Isn't that the whole point of the movie? Is that like the whole gang is Irishmen? There is an Irish gang, but... You gotta watch that movie. That's not Beer Bros homework. That'll be like five hours long for you. That's fine. I love that movie. Alright, All right. let's find some... Uh, some where's, the, so where's the body? Where's the body? <laughs> What's going on here? Where are, you, where are you going? I'm looking for the body. It's like not here, right? Do you think Turn it's like this way? Like over here? Yeah, okay. There All we right. go. Okay. What's up? Oh my Patrick, god. Patrick, don't forget to, uh, Patrick and Chris, don't forget to put your little things here. It's like the same crime again. Can you grab anything? Yeah, what is that? Okay. Deidre Moeller? That's our victim. Back in a second. Parent Teacher Association? Okay. And this is five bucks? It's five dollars. Why not take the money? Or why not All right, so it's not turn it over and visit the church address that's on the other side. It happens way too much to yeah. me. I'm that guy that's like a hundred dollars! Sweet a hundred bucks. Alright, so let's look for some clues. I don't want to look at the body yet. Um Look at the exhibits. We got C. Yeah. Okay. What's that? What is that? Is this just nothing? What is? Oh, okay. there. Foot, footprints. Size eight shoe. Watch. The stopping angle in the Henry case. Was Small men's the footprints. Small men's. Every detail a copycat would want was there in the story. Okay. Let's go to. Uh, that was C. So let's go to B. I think B was the purse. Was it? Yeah. Okay, yeah, B was the purse. Was it? Okay. Is there something else here, or should I just go to the body? Let's look around. I don't s I'm not convinced the body's gonna have everything we need. What was that? The music sounds too much like the sounds. Yeah, maybe we should look at the body. Alright. Should I talk to the coroner? Maybe. Similar remote. To what? Dahlia? I don't think so. Celine it's Henry. That's a closed case. This is probably another oh my sad God. sack who lost his temper with a broad who wouldn't put out. Are you a suspect, Rusty? Watch your mouth, Phelps. All <laughs> oh I'm my saying God. is you got enough to do without reopening closed case. Talk me through it, Mal. Why are you being such a shithead, Rusty? Display, footprints would indicate that she has been stomped. Size of the footprints would seem to indicate a smallish men's shoe. No size on this one? Did Mendez wear? You finished? No, I'm not. At a glance, I would say strangulation is the cause of death. Oh, rope burns. I need to do further tests for semen. Angry boyfriend. If they were married, they'd be at home. If the anus out here in Lover's Lane. is mind if I examine the body? Is uh, uh, damaged again? Then we might be we might have something to worry about. Because that wasn't even mentioned in the crime that we just solved. Yeah. Looks like she was tied up. <sighs> she does it first. But that would leave a mark on her other wrist, too. I oh. think her watch might have been torn off. But he's just stealing jewelry? So let's check her... Can you check her neck? 
I can, but I want to look at her other wrist first because I want to see what the deal is. Just nothing. Oh, her ring. What's this mark? Cut on the finger. Fourth finger, left hand. Yeah. A wedding or engagement ring. Violent dude, this is like the same crime, dude. This is. Yeah. Let's look at the neck. Look at your mark. What is hey. that? Zelda. Yep. Da -da -da -da. Back at the lab and get it's back ropes. To yeah. Huh. And that's it. Patrick, Chris, don't forget to put the uh, pictures of yourselves in the on the body parts. Ugh. Oh. Ooh. God. Okay. Detectives, R and I says a Deidre Mahler of 130 North Bonnie Bray was reported missing this morning by her husband. Hugo. Oh. oh. What I tell you. Hugo Moeller? Husband, take him downtown and work him over. You can have this Damn, that up by sucks. Lunchtime. What about not making assumptions and going on the evidence? Yeah, what the fuck, Rusty? I thought you were cool. Thought you were... Thought you were... Thought you were... Thought you were just a jaded old policeman who was tired of having to do things the right way. I didn't realize you were just a fucking <laughs> sexist <laughs> asshole. Calm the fuck down, dude. Yeah. Like you get paid the same if you solve the crime or not. Like you <laughs> should try and solve the actual goddamn crime. All right, let's get inside. All our residents, let's go. You want him to drive? I'm too paranoid about it. Look, if you want him to drive, I'm not gonna judge. Hey, you. look at our nice car. Look at how clean and nice our car is. Isn't that nice? No. Just like everyone the day knows. I bought it. Everyone knows that you. Drove that car off a cliff unsuspectingly. I don't think I remember doing it. You I, sure I, did. Are you sure that wasn't just a dream that we both had nope, together? No, you, you did that. The husband. If it doesn't work I don't out, know, man. I, I don't know Mueller that that would happen. Enough. More than enough. Look at you that. The road it looks like there's a road, and it just leads into a like, straight into Because there's an underneath road, dude. Around about my third divorce, I realized you almost hit a person. Look, dude. This is like they made it so that you should follow the rules of the road. Man, I don't. But we're cops. We don't believe in rules. Well, that's what I'm saying. We <laughs> are the rules. I have a daughter and a wife. I always forget this about that. You think never talked about them or heard I know, from right? them? It's weird. No, we're not going to respond. We're only we're only perfect dicks for the story, my friend. Yeah. Maybe we'll go back and do some of those. I'll be later. a perfect dick off camera. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like. Because I have no choice, because that's my job. That's my job. <laughs> my job. That's my job. That's Mike Darb. That's Mike Darb's job. Ook. Oh Ook. my god. Oh my god. Ook. Oh my god. Oh my right. god. Oh my god. Oh my god. At least everybody's staying out of the way today. Yeah, because you. Whoa, whoa there, bro. Whoa. Driving. Shoutouts to that old man I saw driving on the uh, out in the road with his, with his old pickup truck called Big Bertha. Is that real? Yeah, Manhattan Beach, California. There is an a older gentleman driving a pickup truck. Lo looks just right out of this game. What does it say, Big Bertha? It's on the red, side? red and white, and it's the banner across the whole side and back. It says Big Bertha. And it's got a 1950s pinup model with just like a beautiful dress. And what it says do you Big Bertha? What do you think the odds are? That he watches Super Beard Bros. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think that's real. You don't think so? No. I I feel like it seems like he's the perfect type of guy. Look, if he's like, I wonder what's happening in L.A. Noir. Oh, <laughs> the Beard Bros. No, I oh would. Oh my God, they found my truck. I'd lose my shit. This one would say. You'd lose it. I'd lose it. That's badass. Ah. Uh, I think I'm gonna start letting my partner drive more often because this is like. Time, time, times, time, time blame. I know, but the comments, Alex. Everyone's saying, you "I'm saying gotta drive." I'm saying, let's just find like a little like let's just spoiler free guide of the times when you should drive. Nah, man, no, no guides. It's not a guide. I just like we're I, just trivia. We just trivia. It I just got, makes I got, the I got show. The checklist. It just makes the show boring. I just, I know. I'm it's, just driving. Look, look. If you think. That the show is boring based on us driving, and yet you're willing to sit there in silence for 45 seconds to a minute to watch me draw a stupid piece of art, <laughs> then yeah. There's a payoff there. This is a payoff here. We're cops. We're going to go bust someone's ass. I'm Look busting, at you. I'm busting that ass. Here we go. 
The Mahler residence. Hugo Hugo Mahler. Uh, all right, let's get in there. Let's crush it. Yo, we're the cops. <laughs> Hello. Phelps and Galloway. Is that a woman? LAPD. Is your father home? Oh, soon. it's a little girl. He's been out looking for mommy. What's your name, miss? Michelle Eloise Mahler. Oh, no. Can we come in? I don't want to tell this girl that her mom is dead. Thank you. Oh, boy. Could you have a seat for me, Michelle? Oh, my God. Don't be an asshole to her, Rusty. We're going to have a look around. All right, let's look around first. Rusty's not going to do jack shit, though, is he? They never do. Note on the counter. What do we got? Grocery list. Grocery list. Grocery list. Don't Grocery forget list. mom's birthday. All right. Well, it's nothing. My partner will explain everything when we get back, okay? A glass. Oh, Ollie, thank God. It is clear, and it is a glass. <laughs> thank God that he's being nice to the little girl. Maybe he has a girl too. He does have a. He does have a girl. Grab the fruit. Mm. This doesn't I wonder if the murderer was a lemon. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it's a lemon. What do you think about? What do you think about the lemons? Is a lemon. What if we just knew? Boots, show me size eight. Oh, show me size eight. I think, oh. dude. I think this is a fucking. Size this eight. is a fucking workaround. It just so happens her fucking husband has size 8 shoes and they want us to go after him. But. Because that would mean that the husband also killed the other. Exactly, dude. That's some. All right. All right. Okay. So what? we got to find some more clues. What the hell is that? What is that? Jewelry? Oh, my God. If it's a missing ring, I'm going to kill myself. No oh my god, it's the same crime. Dude, what do you think the odds are that she's going to be Can like... Can you check the red thing? What do you think the odds are that somebody's going to La Bamba? Like, do you think she goes to La Bamba? Elgin wrist watch. Lady Elgin? Missing watch and body. rings? Jewelry. Dude, this is like freaking me out. This is like the same crime again. Oh, Zelda. <laughs> Right, let's go talk to this woman, little girl, whatever. I don't know. I can't tell how old she is. She's wearing a dress that makes she's her look like an me. old mom. Daddy is trying to find her. Please tell oh my me god! Okay. I don't want to tell this little girl that her mom's I'm sorry dead. Sorry to have to tell you this, Michelle, but god damn, your mother is dead. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> probably not the best. Do you think you could answer a few questions? Very bad at interrogating. Try. Jesus. Okay. Okay. That was all right. What do we got here? Last contact with last a victim. To see your mother. Yesterday afternoon, I went to a dance at Belmont High. Okay. Mommy was supposed to pick me up, but she didn't show. So what did you do then? I was upset. Daddy came instead. Daddy came instead. All right. What do we got? Um, she's being <sighs> a little shifty, actually. She's telling the truth, but she's look also at, hiding look something. Look at, look, look, look at, uh, she's hiding something. Look at that. She's being a little bit she's shifty. Not, now, like, I doubt her because of her insecurities. That's what I'm Does saying. That makes sense. Yeah, that, well, that's not being a sexist jerk. No, I think it's real. I think I think it really is a situation where she's being a little shifty. But she's like, just found out her mom died. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna do it. So yeah. Hanging around the school. Maybe she's just trying to cover herself. What happened? Cover something father? that has nothing to do with no. it. No. I called and called and finally he answered. He came straight away then. Huh. Husband's alibi. So we have an alibi for the husband. What do we... No, we don't. We just have that he didn't answer the phone? She, well, no, he picked up the phone eventually. And he picked up the girl. Some right. Of your mother's jewelry was missing. Okay. Can you describe her things? A ring, a watch. Yes. I never paid much attention to that stuff. 
All right. Let's see. What do you got? I think that's true. Oh, okay. So look at this little look down she does here. I'm like, I'm like, she's still being kind of shifty, but I'm like, is it now because she's sad? She looks look, more like she's, she's she, she just found out her mom died. She looks a little bit more like she's about to cry than she did the last time, which is why I feel like maybe she's telling the truth and she's just looking away because she doesn't want to cry. I agree with you. She's telling the truth. <sighs> it's getting harder. It looks a it's lot. It's getting so it fucking looks hard. It looks a lot like the doubt, but it's not exactly the same. I think she's telling the truth. <sighs> I'm going to go with my first instinct. I know it's painful, Michelle. But this may be important. She wore a wedding ring. Mommy chose it herself. The rose gold wedding band and the matching diamond and ruby engagement ring. She wore a watch? Yes. A yellow gold Elgin watch. Which we found the box for. Her birthday. She knew exactly everything about them when she said she didn't care about the jewelry. It was kind of a makeup present. Got her makeup present. State of the parents' Your marriage. Let's are, talk about it. Uh, happily married? What are you saying? Of course they are. Oh my Ooh, god. Ooh, child. You are full of <laughs> doubt and resentment. <coughs> now she's not lying. Well, they, we have nothing to catch her on anyway. Like, right? Yeah. Like, let's just doubt. Doubt is they basically they you're a liar, but they not as I big as it. yeah. <laughs> she said she would leave him if he ever did it again. Okay. She bought her a brooch pin to make up for it. Why didn't she tell me about the brooch? Golden butterfly. Golden butterfly. All right. So that Thanks brooch might more. be important. You've been very brave. Hey! Yay! Oh my god, it's Greg Grumberg! Yeah, the police room are here. Please, Michelle. I'll talk to the police. You Greg, you look great, dude. Loved you in Star Wars, Greg. Loved you in Heroes. Oh my god. You can't come Park in here man. interrogating her like she's Your some kind of- Your wife was found murdered this morning. Have a found? seat, motherfucker. What? The... But, but she only- We have some questions that we would like to ask you. Sure, yeah. Yeah, I'll do my best. Okay. What was the grave at Luke Skywalker's planet? <laughs> Footprints at the crime scene. All right. What size shoe do you wear, Mr. Muller? Why do you ask? It's routine, sir. Simple process of elimination. Nines, I think. Lied. Lie, 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 lie. lie. <laughs> Why would I lie to you at a time like this? Because we found your shoes <laughs> and their size eight boots. My shoe size? <laughs> you must really be running on empty. You lied, bro. What are you talking about? Did you do the right one? I hit lie. Did you choose the right, the right evidence, though? It didn't give me a chance to do evidence. You did, didn't? No. What? You picked the wrong. Sh you picked the wrong thing, Alex. That's bullshit. It's the fucking footprint. Right, but you we weren't supposed to pick the foot. You're supposed to pick the shoe. Shut it down. Shut it down. We're going shut back. It down. We're shut going it back. down. Yeah, We're going shut back. it down. We're Fuck going it. back. We're going Fuck back. It. Shut it down. Bullshit. That's fucking horseshit. That's some Phoenix Wright bullshit. You know what that is? That's what that is. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Bullshit. You hear me? Do you hear me, America? That's bullshit. That's unbelievable. I will not have my record tarnished by that bullshit. <laughs> you chose the wrong evidence, dude. If it was fucking real life and I was like, the fucking footprint and the scene, you, you right, got- Right, but we weren't talking about the footprint and the scene. Whatever, dude. We were dude. talking about the shoe if size. If it was a real case, I wouldn't have one chance to do it and then mess up. If I was like, uh, well, we find the footprint- Sorry, your boots. Like- they wouldn't be like, you're not a cop anymore. I'm, I, not, I'm not giving up perfect dicks like this. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I, we knew the right evidence. I'm not giving up perfect dicks like this. We knew the answer. There's no way. We were on the complete right page, right? You yeah, you just, you just didn't, you didn't pick the right shoe. That's you, fucking... You picked the shoe print and not the shoe size. I'm just saying, honest mistake, I shouldn't get dinged. It's so similar. I just, I don't understand. It's Phoenix Wright. I just hope that our record is not tarnished. I saved, I saved the crime. I saved the, I, I, I know the answer to the crime and I clicked the wrong thing and then I lost the game. 
I don't even want to finish this Let's Play if it's not a perfect dick. Wow! I'm gonna walk away. Wow! Yeah. Wow! I'll walk away. Wow! I'm over it. Wow! L.A. Noir. Wow! More like L.A. Boar War. Whoa! L.A. Boar War. Whoa! L.A. Boar War. <laughs> I hope we're okay. We're okay. We better be okay. I will literally call Greg Grunberg on the phone and explain to him what happened. <laughs> Greg, 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 hold on. Let's get Greg Grunberg on the show. I don't know him. I want to talk to him about footprints versus boots. Oh, we did this whole thing over again. Give it to me. Give me the controller. I will save this case. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Open the door, girl. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where's your shit? You gotta find everything, Alex. Where's the goddamn find shoe? Find them all, buddy. Give me the shoe. God damn it. Size eight. Size eight. Look. Size eight. That's the evidence that you didn't deliver last Whatever, time. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Should both work. I gotta get the wedding ring from the thing. I gotta get the ring and the watch from the thing. And then I gotta interview the daughter the again. And again. And body. again. Lady Elgin watch. Look at this. Okay. Didn't get anything for that. Give me this one. No sign what do we got? Open it up. Show me the ring. Missing watch and rings. Easy as pie. I'm a detective who can travel through time. Travel through time? This is Undertale. <laughs> uh, just so we're all clear, Undertale is not about traveling through time. All right. Spoilers, dude. Yeah. When did uh, you last see your mother? Let's talk to her. Yesterday afternoon. All right. Last contact with victim. When did you last see your mother? High. Yesterday afternoon? I believe we doubted her. her. She didn't show. So what did you do then? Who's we skip this or no? I can't skip it. I'm scared to press buttons. Belmont High School question mark? Oh my god. So you were hanging around the school. Uh, you're wild. telling a doubt. What happened a doubt. to your father? I don't know. I called and called and finally answered. Oh my god. Answered. What an awful thing. Straight away I can't believe that's how easy it is to not be a perfect dick. Some of your mother's jewelry was missing. I can't Can believe that. I refuse to go down that way. Rain, no way. I'll back to the watch. future to this before I do that. <laughs> Good I lord. I haven't stopped talking for ten minutes how, how flustered I am about this. God. We could have just edited this part out altogether, Alex. We can. What is this? What did she just ask me? Oh, shit. I don't know. This is the truth one, right? I don't know. Which, which the... This is the truth one. I know it's painful. And then the last one is the She's telling the truth, yeah. She wore a wedding ring? And he chose it herself. Yeah. And then she knows all the de the details. And then she's like, with my parents are happily married, and then I say, oh, I don't know about that. And then she she's like, watch. All right, well fine. Yes. The yellow gold Elgin watch. Daddy bought it for her birthday. She says she doesn't care about the jewelry, and then she like describes it perfectly. I just don't understand. Kind of a makeup present. <laughs> oh my god. How embarrassing. What an awful what an awful way to lose the perfect record. It's like the same thing as Barry Bonds baseball being in the Hall of Fame. It's like, yeah, like it's in the Hall of Fame, but like remember that one time when you chose the fucking footprints instead of the boots? It's okay, dude. I forgive you. But will America forgive me? I forgive you. You just you Happily you made here. you made a dummy. But will but will America forgive me, are. Gerard? Look, if you forgive Alex, tweet at him or comment, because in my as far as I'm concerned. I'm okay, so I doubt now, right? They weren't happy That's what we did last out. time? Yes. Did your father ever hit your mother? Just as far as I'm concerned, I'm still a perfect dick. Oh my god. I'm still a perfect dick. I knew! I knew the answer! I've solved three of the crimes before we left the first crime scene. Remember that? Thanks, Miss. Remember how good I am? You've been very That's a question for you, America. I'm the sharpshooter! That's a question for you guys at home. I'm the sword of justice! Daddy, the police are here. We got so infatuated by Greg Runberg. Go to room, I gotta, I gotta talk to him and tell him She's what happened. I'm gonna ask him if I can, if I can ask Greg so Runberg, if I explain to him the whole situation, and then he tells me that I'm still a perfect dick. I don't even what? care what America says. But until then, but 
I beg you. Okay. Let's be chill you about this and do this like the right way. The right, Fuck. correct way. Fuck. Yeah, All right. Fuck. Here we go. Calm, boys. Calm. Calm, boys. Why do you ask? Footprints at the crime scene. It's routine, sir. Nine. Simple process of elimination. Nines, I think. God damn it. Why are you lying to me? Nines, you're a liar. No, not true. Why would I lie to you at a time like this? So this time, we're going to choose the shoe size, yeah, Alex. Fine. Size the eight work boots. Work here, here we go. Boots. Why lie about it if you've got nothing to hide? Because I always get teased about the size of my feet. You know, small feet, small... Always been true in my experience. That is really bad, dude. <laughs> oh, don't you sick off for him. He wasn't sticking up for him. He was telling me he's a small dick. Let's talk about the... Uh... God, I'm never going to get over this. Al the this is why cops drink, dude. You stayed in while what? your wife went out to pick up your daughter? Now I want to have three fingers yes, of rye. Correct. All right, all right, all right, all right. Wrong. He's lying. What did he just say? Wait. He just said he stayed here while his wife went to go pick up his daughter. It's just not true. It didn't happen. Look at the notebook. Husband's alibi. Michelle Mahler reports calling home repeatedly with no answer on the night of the murder. Yeah. Yeah, full of shit. Right? Yeah. I'm not crazy. I'm never going to be able to make a choice like this again. I'm ruined forever. I no He's full of shit. Right? You should come clean if you're Correct? Having an affair. He's full of shit. Something's okay. Going on. I told you I was here. What are you saying? I wasn't. No, your fucking daughter your is. Your daughter ratted you out, dude. Husband's so alibi. Husband's alibi. <sighs> okay, I went out for a while. I was I was driving around. It's my way of relaxing. Why did you lie? You shit. You're so. You're so. You're so. We have a new option now. Missing History persons report. Or history of violence. Should I go? I, I'm just going to go in order. Let's go down the order, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Uh, my wife didn't come home last night. She left around... She left around 9.30. Uh, Michelle was out of dance. She called me to let me know that Deidre didn't turn up. Look, you're um, not lying about that, but I don't trust you either. Uh, Did your wife ever go out by I herself? doubt him. The bars, nightclubs. Yeah. No, I go ahead and doubt him. What are you? What are you suggesting? You suggesting my wife's loose? <laughs> now is not the, the La Bamba. Time for you to be pushing me, Mister. <laughs> Your daughter said you were having an argument. We argued about who. What are you going to do? Up. Punch me, Michelle? I worked a full day. I wanted to come home, put my feet up. <laughs> Your wife was beaten and then strangled. Oh my God! And <laughs> history of violence. <laughs> And a history of violence towards your wife. That's not that's not true, god damn it. Yes, it is, bro. Yeah, you're a liar, look, dude. Look at, this is this is this is the answer, right? Domestic violent incident. Yeah. It is true, Hugo. We okay. got you. You're a, you're yeah, a liar. We got you, dude. You try to keep a lid on it at home, but sometimes you lost control. Your daughter and your wife were scared of you. You don't know anything about me. Oh, yeah? Then what about the time Let's you... Let's talk about that butterfly brooch. What about the brooch about that the you got for your wife after a domestic your violence the incident, Greg Grunberg? Her. She liked to spend money, all right? Dresses, uh, jewelry, her hair. It drove me goddamn crazy. This guy's also the voice of you Captain Kirk's like dad in the, new J in the new J.J. Star Wars. Nobody likes a cheap That's story. right. Calm down, dude. Getting hostile with us is a very bad idea, Hugo. I'm no murderer. <laughs> Make some God damn it. We're still perfect at this point. Whatever. Station. I don't know. Question. I'm going to carry yeah, it with me in my yourself. heart forever. Put the cuffs on. I'm not a perfect dick. Just for the record, I'm a perfect dick. But I'm Alex wearing, is negative one on Alex. I'm wearing a suit. And don't make me come get the awards. <laughs> but I'm not perfect. Should go not back a perfect in there and dick. bust his ass. I believe you though, man. You, you we knew that we talked out? about it. We, I, I knew the right answer. I Two, thought I was choosing the right thing. Violence, which probably goes for half the minute. I want to be like the murderer. Three, no whatever. 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 God damn it. Hello, detective. Oh yo, why are you waving us down? Hey cops, what's up? I saw 
this dude murdering his wife last Let's talk night. To talk to the neighbor. Should I call in the? Should I call in something? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go talk to her first. Yes, ma'am. I heard the. Shut up! I'm the police. The radio. And you can help us with our inquiries. Yes, sir. They had a row last night. I heard Mrs. Muller screaming. Did you see Mrs. Muller come home late last night at all? No, not at all. I did see Mr. Mahler put something in the incinerator earlier this morning, though. Ugh. I told you he was our guy. Now let's get this bum downtown. Oh and do it shit! Down. Look, there he is now. Wow. Oh my That's God! Why, why would it start me like running into a car? Don't let him get away. Okay, but no shooting. We need this guy. Why would you? Can you pull out the gun or no? Um, no. Tackle. <sighs> Didn't tackle him. Tackle. Tackle. Extra tackle. Tap I'm, it. Tap I'm, it. I'm, I'm tapping tap it. it. I'm tapping it over and over. Tap it. Tap it. Tap okay, it. Tap I'm it. still tapping it. <laughs> I've been tapping it for as long as I live. Go, baby. Why is he running? Why is he running? Dude, what is up here? What is going on? Everybody's like the murderer. That's your chance. Tackle him. Hands where we can see them. You're bobbed, Hugo. Shoes. He's burning his own shoes. Oh, dude. Get him booked in at Central Officer. Then put him in an interview room. We'll be speaking with him later. And inform the captain. Yes, sir, detective. Dude, what the fuck is Someone happening? These murders problems. are exactly the same. I don't... It's a moment. You need somewhere to stay, Michelle. You have other family? Grandparents? Aunts or uncle? Call Aunt Helen, but she lives in Bakersfield and... Call her. We're gonna get someone down here from Juvenile Hall to talk to you in the meantime. We ought to get some uniforms down here, clean up. What? Take care of the kids. Crazy. Yo, use yeah. the use the payphone now. Yeah. Hey, isn't he the cop that won a medal? This is freaking me out, man. These murders were exactly no. the same. Homicide Easy. Yeah, but different situations. But we have two different guys. It's weirding me out. I wonder if they're actually the murderers. I wonder if he actually can explain the blood. I need an address on a Belmont high school. Checking for you, detective. Oh right! I forgot oh, we're about going Belmont. to the high school. I forgot about Belmont High School. So it's not over yet. I guess not. Huh? All right. Next time on Beard Bros. I guess we're gonna go to the high school. We're gonna go to Belmont High School. Question right. of the day. Yeah. What's your favorite Greg Grunberg? Wait. Roll. Got it, KGPL. Oh, the morgue. Some stuff from the body. Let's go to the. Should we go to the morgue first, or go to the high school? Uh, I don't know. I don't know which one is more pressing. I mean, it's a dead body, right? So maybe we should just go to high school. I don't know. We'll see. Next time on Beard Bros. Next time on Beard Bros. Question of the day: What's your favorite Greg 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 Grunberg role? Landerman. Mine is uh, Snaps West Wexley. <laughs> oh, Landerman. Snap Temmins. Snap Wexley. Later. Later.